Hey gang, welcome back. It is Camp Cowboy here with another video. So this video is going to be a part one video. So I want to go ahead and talk to you about, you know, a little bit about equipment. So right now we have a couple of events going on that revolve around spending. So I want to go ahead and just talk about this. So right now, you know, we have this gold rush. So you get a whole bunch of different rewards for spending gold. And if you look at the rewards that you're getting, they're actually better than the packs and better than the amount that you're spending to get it. Like, for example, 18,000 gold. So this is less than $100. $100 gives you 22,000 gold in a pack. Right off the bat, you're getting 100,000 gold for that. As well as everything else that you're going to be getting. For 30,000 gold, you get 50,000 T7 archers. So I'm looking at this, I'm getting, you know... 100,000 T7 archers, I'm getting some Outcry material chests. Maybe it's time to go buy some Outcry in order to get this gold and unlock that. Not to mention, you also get a loyalty bonus for spending gold. So, let's go ahead and... This is a part one video because I want to, you know, take the most realistic and cheapest route possible to go ahead and get this gear. So... What this entails is I bought three pieces of Outcry gear outright. So, already crafted gear. I've been grinding out the weekly specials and the daily specials for chests, as well as buying these outright um, packages. Now, with the outright packages, we're also going to be getting some chests to go ahead and get the materials we need to craft. So, let's go ahead and take a look at this. So, we're getting 150 Outcry material chests per pack. So 450 plus the 300 plus everything else that I've received. That is the wrong tab. Let's go ahead and open up some of these chests. So right now we have 750. Let's go ahead and open them up. Got a whole bunch of materials all across the board. Looking good so far. I mean, some of these materials are not that good. We get, We are getting, though, some epic and immortal. So that's exactly what we're looking for. Alright, so that's 350. Got another 400. So, we're getting the Crafted Sapphire in Immortal, so that's good. We want to see that. Nothing's Cemetery Soil except for some Epic. Defiled Wood, Epic again. Suspicious Pouch in Epic. Seal of Outcry in Immortal. Black Unicorn Leather in Immortal. Bone of the Executed in the Immortal times 2. And Witch's Tear, so that's, that was a good open. Um, and a couple more packs, nothing fantastic with that. So let's go ahead and open up our forge and go to our set of codex and start looking towards getting the rest of our two pieces. So we could go ahead and craft. Now, we can look at this and we can say, okay, we could get 100% of crafting, or you can go ahead and try to shoot for maybe you doing a 80%. If we can go ahead and get this guy up to getting him to immortal this defiled wood and then this allows us to have an 80 percent using our most expensive material in order to get that 80 80 percent so looking across we want to go ahead and also use this guy at about 60 percent just to make our cost of crafting cheaper because then again i only have one at immortal but I, ha I can have five at the epic. Now let's go ahead and just group combine, see what we can get. So right off the bat, we can go ahead and do three at immortal. So just in case, like, all right, I want to finish the set off. I don't want to really waste anything. Let's go ahead and we can easily get the rest of my gear up to immortal. So let's go ahead and finish this off. Now, I'm only doing 100% just because I know this cost is so high, I don't want to, you know, risk anything. I would risk it on Conqueror, I'd risk it on Berserker, but with Outcry being level 40 and being so expensive to obtain, I'm going to take the safe route, I'm going to take the 100% because I know that if I were to mess up, my cost to go ahead and craft this would now turn into about $140 rather than just $100. So you're going to have about a 40% increase in, cr in cost. So let's go ahead. We're going to hit the help button. 
and we are also going to go ahead and just speed through this just so that we can see the effect of it and get everything done with this regard. Alright. So we got it in um, Immortal, so now we can go ahead and craft our bow now, our off um, our offhand, I should say. We're not doing that, just want to make sure. Alright, um, don't know why it's not showing up. Alright, but we do have this, so we're going to go ahead and get our offhand crafted. So I was expecting to pay probably another 100 to 200 dollars in order to obtain my outcry, my level 40 outcry, at the, you know, the full set. So I was expecting, okay, I'll put down 500 dollars and I'll get 500 dollars worth of outcry. Well, now that I have it crafted, I only spent 300 dollars to obtain it, you know, it's a lot cheaper. Now, there is another way that you can do this. We have weekly special packs of our outcry as well as all the other level 40 gear so let's scroll down to our chest oh it's limited time it's not equipment so there's a daily chest and this gives you 15 chests um a daily pack for a dollar which gives you 15 chests so you can work on grinding that out. That would be $30 per type per month um, to grind it out. And you can also go ahead and do a weekly pack once we can find it, if I can find it. However, I've already purchased all of them. And that weekly pack will give you 75 chests per month. Uh, per week, I should say. My bad. So I believe this is $5 to obtain for 75 chests per week. So that's the best way to go ahead and grind out your level 40 gear for a lot cheaper. So we're just under seven days. So I'm just going to go ahead and use a seven day just to go ahead and get it done. And now we have a full set of Alcry gear. So now I have saved myself $200. Um, I didn't, you know, really grind it out. However, I saw the deals due to um, all, you know, the gold rush and I decided hey now is the time to go ahead and buy that outcry if you can go ahead and afford it so we've got ourselves a full set here five out of five so now I can start looking of enhancing getting some enhancement rings putting it into the necklace um, and then maybe perhaps crafting yet another necklace in order to fill that final slot because we do have six slots so there will be a part two to this video with what I decide to do with the rest of the spending. Um, and then it leads up to a much larger meaning. So more on this in a minute. Thank you all for watching. This is Captain Cowboy. Do not forget to subscribe. Um, share this video with your alliance, with your friends. And also if you are new to Iron Throne, go ahead join the Discord server. Um, and I've also got a link to go ahead and download the game. And it's much worth it your time to utilize that link um so if you want to go ahead and join iron throne i am in the newest kingdom kingdom 50 thank you all for watching this is kevin cowboy